As many of you know, you can get skirting boards in a variety of materials and this can alter the look and feel of the finished product. There are many wood types such as softwood, pine in this example, and hardwoods such as oak. However, MDF is the most popular choice for making skirting boards today. The same can also be said for the architrives. In today's video, I'll be explaining the differences between MDF and pine skirting and architrive to see why you may want one over the other. MDF is a man-made material which is called medium density fiberboard. This is made up of many materials including softwood fibres and even recycled materials which are then all compressed in a crusher to form a wooden board. MDF is great for many reasons. Unlike pine, there's no knots or imperfections and MDF requires less time to prepare. This is because all it needs is sanding down for smoothness and then primed ready for the final paint finish. MDF is also great as it's quick to get prepared. Skirting and architrives are good examples of what can be made, along with certain toys, furniture and so on. If you choose to use MDF, you'll be happy to know that it can accommodate almost any height you require for skirting boards. It can range from 70mm to 400mm, but it can also do below and above this height if required. If you need better quality MDF or moisture resistant boards, HGF, known as high density fibre boards, are slightly more expensive but can survive damp conditions and have higher quality fibres packed in for a much smoother clean finish and tougher exterior. Since MDF can be machined so quickly, it's the material of choice for most people. MDF is also cheaper than pine, making it great for keeping costs down. Higher quality MDF also reduces the risk of furriness occurring, which is not ideal when it comes to skirting and architrives. Pine skirting or architrive is a natural wood. Examples of pine are fifth grade redwood, which are used typically for skirting boards and architrives. One big difference between pine and MDF is the grain. Pine looks like a normal wood, but MDF has no grain whatsoever. Pine is available in sizes between 69mm and 218mm. Unfortunately, this does make it quite limited in comparison to MDF. Although pine is great and looks very nice, there's a few shortcomings with it. First, pine is not as tough or as water resistant compared to the better quality MDF offered on the market. Another problem is due to pine being natural, some boards may have issues with tree deformities, thus causing the pine to look very ugly and in some cases unusable. Pine costs much more to manufacture and treat compared to MDF, thus pine itself costs quite a bit higher too. Knots are very common in pine. Although manufacturers do their best to avoid them or treat them where possible, they will always be present and can fall out causing a hole in the skirting. We would always recommend MDF over pine as it's easier to deal with, cost effective in the long run and it can be made quicker than pine. However, we hope this video explains in greater detail the differences and the advantages or disadvantages with going with either pine or MDF skirting. Now, choose your material and marvel at the results. And that concludes our video. Hopefully you found it useful and insightful and until next time, we will see you in our next video.